Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Panini Prism Football. Brand new release just dropped today, 12 box, pick your team number two. A little bit of break credit being given away if you bought at least two teams. And big thanks to all of these folks for getting into it. 12 box, pick your team two. Thanks to Mark Matson, Last Bot Mojo, Carolina Panthers. And there's everybody else right there. Appreciate everyone getting into the action. Let's actually set the white balance a little bit there. There we go. That looks good. All right. We've got Nick Jaspi's help. So the camera above my head, you'll see his hands there ripping open some boxes. So thanks to him for that. And let's see what we got in here. Now the first case, for the first full case that Nick did earlier today, I, I, I walked into the room at the last box and he did a recap. It was pretty fire. It was really good. I don't know if we just lucked out with that first case or if they're all like this, but we're going to find out soon enough. And there is a checklist now, so. Oh good. There is a checklist now. Good? Looked uneven, yeah, but it's good. Why is this box hot, you know? That's what I why is this? Folks, look at this mystery right here. Wait, what? Why is that box higher? Whoa. Wait, how many boxes are in this case? Oh, look at this. Hold on. Whoa. Whoa, how did that happen? How did that happen? What? Uh, it was like the balancing rock. Wow. There was some sorcery there. There was some sorcery. What is it? The nine myths of the world? Yeah, it's the seven, one of the seven, seven wonders, myths? wonders of the world. Patrick K says, oh, you bought into a spot random? Oh, you won't win a spot in the random? What, for the triple crown break that we have on jazbeescasebreaks.com? I'll tell you what, Patrick K, if you don't buy a spot, I can guarantee that you'll never win. But if you do buy a spot, that guarantee doesn't hold. So I appreciate your trying. Norma Jean, what's going on? Is there a, is there a case hit in prison football? No. This is the first box right here. At the end of the break, if you bought at least two teams, then you'll get at least you will get one entry for break credit. The last time we did the randomizer for the money, there was only nine spots. So one out of nine spots got a hundred bucks of break credit. I don't know who it doesn't look like there's too many in this round either. Alright, so there's the first box right here. Good luck everybody. There's Deonta Hightower to 99. But you just know you won't be one of the top three, Patrick? I can't guarantee that. That I cannot guarantee. If you didn't buy a spot, I could guarantee that. There's Julian Love to, one, uh, to 249 for the Giants. So, as usual for breaks like this, no veteran commons will ship. And a 149 Chris Carson for the Seahawks. But obviously all rookie cards and all inserts will ship. I kind of like that design this year. There's like this, these little, what are these? Yeah, I like that. I don't know what's going on there, but I like it. I now 249 like David Johnson. Too, when they kind of had the photo blend in almost. Yeah. Up in the middle. Yeah, I like that. The gold vinyls look awesome too. That's always... There's Calais Campbell, 49 out of 75. Definitely nothing like Super Tractors. That will be for the Jaguars. Right, it's just gold vinyl. Randall with the Jags. And they're out of five. There's Cortland Sutton to 49. You're Broncos. Like, well, we better change it. We gotta change it to out of five. <laughs> Is it like, do they have, does the other guys have that trademarked? Super I, I guess not. Maybe the name of it, yeah. But out of 75, but not the design. Brian Burns is our first autograph. That goes to Mark Matheson um, with the Panthers. I guess I'll just slide these over here. We'll top load the autographs. Um, with the Panthers, last spot mojo. Nice, random letter gone. Great, let's add that to the schedule. 
I'm down for that, Rex. Angels Cubs World Series. Joe Madden did say today in the press conference he wants to beat the Cubs in the World Series this year. So some revenge. What's in each box here? Three autos. Three autos in each box. Nine parallels. All right. There's DeAndre Hopkins to 199. There's Dexter Williams. Sensational signatures for the Packers. That will be for Ann. Ann with the pack. Got Brandon Cooks to 99. No, to 175. There's Tyler Higby to 199. It's another Ram. And Bryce Love is your third autograph. And there's Darius Slayton and DeAndre Baker. Bryce Love, rookie auto for Nathaniel Murphy with the Redskins. There you go. Alright, so each stack will represent a box. So here is the next stack right here. All right, good luck. This kid's annoying. Oh, in the AWS yes. commercial? How do they know that? Yeah, it's like, you it's God. Times. God, you stupid kid. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, it's computers. God, times. it's computers. God, stupid kid. There's a database. I feel like that's a bad job by the parents. Yeah. Why, why are you not explaining to your child yeah, how all this works? Her. They don't even respond. They don't even respond. Bad parents. Sam Darnold to 199. Rex, I think I'd be salty too if I won a World Series for a city that hadn't won a World Series in decades and then I got fired three years later. Just because the GM has made bad moves. Caleb Wilson. Right, and he blames the man. So obviously we need to bring David Ross in. Yeah. <laughs> David Ross versus Joe Madden. The Cubs might not win a game this year. Oh, and 162, yeah. the curse the curse of Joe Madden. Yeah, and the like Angels you, are 162 You, you, you and sold your souls for a World Series, and now you'll pay for it. And then his restaurant goes out of business. Sad in times. Chicago, Deontay sad Thompson, time. Aaron Pettit with that one. So we'll keep our autographs out here so we can keep track of the autos. They bench how Kendrick for a dribble come around because he's yeah. hitting like 340 off of breaking. I should have put him in my DFS lineup. Yeah. I didn't do a DFS. That's a hot bit. tip. I didn't do anything today. There's Kyle Rudolph to 175. No, Top Fire isn't a hobby anymore. It was one year, but then they stopped. They did a football set. I don't know There's Andy know. Isabella, a second Cardinal in this box for Aaron Pettit. Maybe we can find the guy that throws him the ball. Well, yeah, he was let go. That's the same thing. They didn't re-sign him. Semantics. Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> That's the excuse. <laughs> I know. <this> Rex, <laughs> Rex sounds like Rex works in the front office. Yeah, He's does. like, no, 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 he wasn't fired. He just wasn't re-signed. Yeah. We couldn't reach a deal. Yeah. Out of 249, Jabril Peppers. Um, she's here. Post office, yay! Roger Staubach to 400. We've got a huge, a huge pile of stuff getting shipped out for you, ladies and gentlemen.
There's Jordan Reed to 149. Now, obviously, with stuff like this, it's going to take a little bit longer for us to sort and ship all this stuff out. So just make sure that you give our shipping team just an extra day or so to get all this stuff out to you. Darius Slayton for the Giants. That'll be for Sen Yin. Yeah, true, Rec. We gotta, we gotta be, we gotta be accurate, but you know, we are, we are missing crucial subtext, though. All right. There's Dick Buckus to one seventy-five. I'm just your package, isn't it? This Dick going to Rick T and the Bears. That's his name. Where does Dick go to? That Dick goes to Rick T. Chicago Bears. Inappropriate. I don't think I'm being... That's his first name. What, what's his last name? Butt Kiss. Dick Butt Kiss. I think you're the one being inappropriate. Grow up, Nick. Sorry. <laughs> 34 <laughs> out of 99 Adam Humphreys. I walked in and that was the first thing I heard. <laughs> Gosh, Nick, just crawl up, dude. Daryl Henderson for the Rams. Just trying to run a run a mature trying to mind, I guess. Just trying to run a mature family friendly breaking operation here and you're just twisting around the names of legends. There's Daryl Henderson for the Rams. John McCall with the Rams. Boy, I thought Daryl Henderson was gonna be a lot better this year. But he has a chance. Malcolm Brown is out this week. Tyler Higby to one ninety nine, so you know, they're not going to run Todd Gurley 40 times a game, so Daryl Henderson should get some opportunities. Maybe a flex spot in your D. Oh, points. We'll randomize that to one person in the break as a lot. Offer cool. who, Warner? The, our mail? What, who? Uh, Area? Oh. Sorry, Logan. If it was you, Logan, we'd offer you water. She had AirPods in and she was just hustling. Yeah. I turned the corner and it's gone. She was gone, yeah. With all the packages. She's pretty efficient. Very efficient. Got a smile on her face all the time. It's Quadralis into 175. Is she out of the same branch as uh, our previous guy? Yeah. Redondo B. Yeah. Does she have stories? About him? Uh huh. No. We should that. ask. We should ask. See who was. Because. He was the, there's Miles Gaskin. You would think he was the, you would think he was the yeah. problem? Yeah. It's like when you're looking for the sucker in the room and you don't see the well, sucker and you're like, the sucker. Like they would never send replacements when he was missing, but then when we moved here, when she's gone, there's always replacements. There's and Miles Gaskin for the Dolphins. Too, which I Interesting. guess. He's Brian? not older, so. Yeah. It makes sense. He's but allowed. Send your replacement then. Or whatever. Interesting. Interesting. DeAndre Hopkins to 199. It's a lot of drama. But it's all, all right. solved now. All solved now. So that those points, by the way, replace the third autograph here, so I wouldn't expect a third here. There's Mark Ingram the second though. UPS is good. FedEx is still bad for us. Ooh. So I stopped we stopped using it ever since last week. It's on the ban list right now. Seventy five Hunter Renfro. On the band list. If Logan moved out here, would we trust him to be our mail carrier? Sure. You he sure? Just, he, but he knows what's inside. I, that's what I'm that's saying. Would we trust him? They go. Here's a really nice Aaron Rodgers card we're shipping. Yeah, I know. Like, it's like, dear Jaspies, my my Aaron Rodgers hit never made it to me. Everyone else is shipping fine. For some reason, only Packers and Utah Jazz hits just tend not to make it to their to their rightful owners. Ever since Logan started delivering our route,
There's Devin White to 199, Buccaneers. Redemption for somebody, for a valued collector. You're a valued collector, ladies and gentlemen. We value you. Panini values you. We all value you. Let's see what's on the other side. Any guesses on the other side of that? Marquise Brown. Yeah. Ha hasn't Marquise Brown been banged up? He's not been playing? No, he should sign that. Yeah, he, that's, that's a perfect time to start signing stacks of cards. That's Harrison Butker. He's 25. He has to be this week. He touched the butt. It's Travion Williams to 149. My season's over. Wait, you got to win this season? Or this week? Yeah. I think I, I do too. I'm playing 6 1 height town, but he's got a Lamar Jackson on by. Oh. One of the, one of the quarterbacks. Those flashback autographs. Willis McGahee. I don't know. I, might, I may need to trade him somebody. 24 out of 25. Buffalo Bills, Aaron Pettit. I mean, we're competing for a playoff spot, Nick. I don't know. I think he offered me, like, Robbie Anderson for, like, Phillip Rivers or something like that. And I was like, Robbie Anderson? Get out of here. He's never be on the teams. It's just like, go ahead, lose to Nick. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe oh, no, a, a better offer. I played the person without Odell Beckham, Juju Smith-Schuster. She was playing one quarterback, and that quarterback was Patrick Mahomes who played two quarters, and I lost. I can't believe that happened. But she also scored, like, the high of the week, so I don't know how she did it. Well, how did she How did she know. do that? That was unbelievable. It was Julio to 249. I was so confident I'd even wake up to set my team. Wow. <laughs> I was like, I don't 9 care. 9.55 a.m. alarm, yeah, you wake like, up. I don't care. Didn't do that. I'm going to win this week. Didn't even <laughs> matter. Didn't even, didn't even check injury reports. So it was just like, it's fine. I don't need I to set was, that alarm. I was blindsided. Devontae Adams is a little you-know-what. That's what I say. Josh Dodson to 149. Out seven weeks for turf toe. Give me a break. <laughs> there he is right there. Yeah. A little toe injury, and I'm out six weeks. Apparently, apparently turf toe is pretty brutal. All right, there's Drew Locke. Cam asking, I'll give you three guesses on what this is, Cam. Drew Locke, Broncos. That'll be for Ann. I had Saquon Barkley get hurt. Devontae Adams get hurt. Carrion Johnson is now out for the year. I had Deshaun Jackson out for the year. So my team's just riddled with injuries. Hey, what happened to Carry on Johnson? Why why is he I'm pretty sure turf toe is the is like a inflammate a very severe inflammation of the ball of the, the main ball right under your big toe. A little cut on and the it's toe. not a cut. It apparently it's a lot worse than people think it is. It sounds like such a baby injury, but like and you basically can't run, can't cut, can't plant that foot, and then push off him, with your toe. Then put him on the IR because he's been <laughs> Q for six weeks saying, oh, he's back Yeah, I don't know why game. they didn't IR him for eight weeks and then brought him back at eight week eight. But All right, the redemption is Irv Smith Jr., rookie autographs, Prism Red Wave. That goes to the Vikings. That will be for Tony Covert. Yeah, one more guess, Cam. Right, and that's the other thing. Logan's right, yeah. The, the bone actually pushes into the meaty part of your foot. It's pretty painful. But the injury just sounds... The, the, the injury designation sounds so much, like, softer than it is. It's like, turf toe. <laughs> and you're like, oh, your big toe hurts? But, yeah, the, that, that ball of your foot right there... I mean, it's almost as bad as, uh, there's Curtis Samuel. I think plantar fasciitis is the other one. Plantar fasciitis, I believe. Welcome to medical school with your host, Joe Jaspi. I play a doctor on TV. Um, plantar fasciitis, I think, is the big tendon on the bottom of your foot, right? Is that what it is? That hurts, too. If you heard that. That's what, that's what Tyrell 
Williams, I think, has, among other people. Chris Godwin, what injury would it take to hurt my breaking? Would be my tarsals? Meta tarsals? Or are those my feet? Some kind of some kind of uh, digit injury. Um, I suppose like a wrist injury. My wrist gets but I always stretch out my wrists. So because you don't get you can get the carpal like right here. I don't have that. I don't have that. There's Marquise Goodwin to 175. But any sort of I guess upper body injury related to the arms, which also be your back. Bo Jackson, 13 out of 25. This guy knows. Flashback autographs. That goes to my Raiders. EA Sports, it's in the game with my Raiders. 13 out of 25. Nice, that's autograph one right here. Uh, have I, I have not looked into insurance on my hands, face, and voice. I should though. Where can I get that, where can I get that uh, insured? Out of 199, Damian Williams. And I try to take care of the voice. A lot of Jameson and uh, a lot of Jameson and unfiltered lucky strikes. That, that preserves the voice, right? Twenty one out of forty nine. Miles Garrett. Now we can you got football to talk about what do you got for us? Brett Favre to one seventy five. And everyone sees all the all the rest of the stacks right here will represent the rest of the case. Big thanks to Nick for uh, taking care of that for us. There's Rashawn Gary for the Packers. It's our second autograph of the box for Ann. And there will be an autograph recap at the end of this too. Plus anything under, I guess, five or less. I should have mentioned that at the beginning of the break. Instead of 20 minutes in. Exactly, Sean. There's Earl Thomas out of 249. Yeah, if it's interesting, we'll talk about it. We got Leonard Fournette to 75. Would I agree for the Bills to trade for AJ Green? There's Demarcus Lawrence. Well, Bills do need a wide receiver. Is AJ Green healthy? I mean, I wouldn't. I mean, who could the Bills move for AJ Green? Is he healthy? Is he even going to play this season? That's the concern. Otherwise, no. But if they got inside information where they're like, yeah, A.J. Green's going to be fine in a week, why not? There's Zach Allen for the Cardinals if they have the assets to move. That's for Aaron Pettit. All right, so there are your three autographs right here. Nice Bo Jackson for EA. Let's move on to the next one. Let's grab this one that's on the farthest side right here. But yeah, is AJ Green healthy? I think that's the big issue. Next box. Kenny Saylor was such a rock star. If anybody watched the hour show on him, he, yeah, he was pretty cool. A little bit past my time. There's Lamar Jackson, but but yeah, he epitomized epitomized cool. I think. There's Eric Reed, Jack Doyle, two forty nine. NFL's too safe these days. Everyone thinks they're a brand. Everyone wants to be corporate. No one does rock star stuff anymore. Oh, Sorry, more points. That'll that'll be combined with that other other points set over there. I wish they would have the points this side up, but out of two forty nine, Randall Cobb. But I mean, if he's not healthy, how is he going to help Josh Allen with, with deep routes? That's the issue. There's another Bo Jackson right there to 75. No, I don't think that's interesting, Sean Corbett. 
That doesn't sound like an interesting topic, especially in a especially in a football break. It's not too relevant. We don't need to talk about that. To 175, Bobby Wagner. And we got Rodney Anderson, Bengals. Bengals should trade A.J. Brown, though. What are they going to do with him? That goes to Ricky Buffalo. We're on Cincinnati. Buffalo. Clay Matthews to 49. Greg Olson to 149. There's David Long. Now I see a certain name. Speaking of the Seahawks right there, is this a, are they trolling us? Or is this actually Oh! It says sensational signatures on the side. Russell Wilson. That is sensational. Might be your MVP this year. Perfect timing because Cam was asking, what if the Seahawks try to get Delaney Walker away from, from the Titans? But Bo Jackson and then this guy, Russell Wilson, dangerous. What's the story with Will Disley? If Disley's out for an extended period of time, maybe they should go for it. But I I just feel like trades in general doesn't just doesn't happen in football that often, so kind of hard to speculate. All right, Seahawks, that was Harry Morgan. Once again, congrats to you on that. And then points was the third autograph. It's a nice hit. Possible MVP. Oh, is he out for the year? Maybe we'll start seeing more more trades. Torn Achilles for Disley? That's a shame. Well, the, there's two bird teams facing each other. There's Jack Doyle, 15 out of 25. Um, Seahawks are at um, Atlanta. What do you guys think about that game? The Se Seahawks just dominate, right? Seahawks win by like 10. I don't know if Matt Ryan's even playing. That team, I just thought, I thought that Falcons team was going to be so much better. There's Bradley Chubb. He's out for the year too. There he is, but he's got like a, he's got a busted ankle. Matt Ryan's not playing that that this week. They shouldn't play him. There's Delaney Walker. We're just talking about him to 99. And nice. Juju Smith-Schuster. Color burst. I think these are very short printed. Michael Gallucci, what is this? One, someone was saying in the chat, one per one every ten cases. Sean, was you were you saying? Someone was saying that. Gary, maybe. Wow. Michael Gallucci, steel curtain with the Juju Smith Schuster color burst. That's really nice. That's a cool shot. Gary was. That's what Gary was. There you go. Dalvin Cook to 175. Robert Woods to 199. 
Miles Sanders, orange, to 249. That will be for the Eagles, Paul Hutchins. I feel like we haven't seen the real Eagles team yet. Once they, once they get healthy, if they get... There's Marquise Brown popping out right here, too. That's for Joe Hauer and his Ravens. Ravens looked great in Seattle last weekend. If the Eagles can get healthy, I feel like they can even start making some things happen. John McCall has that Jack Doyle, by the way. I don't think I mentioned his name. This is Michael Thomas. 10 out of 10, Michael Thomas. Nice. Landon Collins to 75. What about Chris Harris to the Eagles? <laughs> Nick Jasper was saying yesterday, he was so frustrated with the Eagles secondary, he said, I would have taken Gary Ann Conley from the Raiders for, for anything. <laughs> Chris Godwin. I think the Broncos should, uh, Terry Godwin, sorry, going to the Panthers, Mark Matson. And I think the, the Broncos should just so just sell, sell it off, sell off the rest of the farm. Get some draft picks, rebuild that team. Remember Sean Gary, Packers to 199. There's Jordan Reed to 249. Yeah, Mothra, just too too many, too many injuries. Deshaun Jackson being out actually kind of hurt them more than I thought they would. I thought the running game would be a little bit more effective, but that didn't quite pan out. It's okay. It's not bad, but it didn't pan out the way I thought it would. Um, but Deshaun Jackson just doesn't stretch the field. They don't have a Deshaun Jackson to stretch the field. So that makes it difficult for them to, to operate the rest of their game. There's Darius Leonard. Saints trade for Devontae Parker, Cam's suggesting. Uh, I don't think they need a Devontae Parker, do they? I don't think they'd do that. I mean, I think they would gladly add Devontae Parker if he was like a free agent or whatever, but I don't know if they want to give up assets for Defonte Parker. I think they feel like they're doing fine. Out of 199, Will Fuller. I'll have Drew Brees coming back soon, too. Logan, Nick said there was a checklist. Probably CardboardConnection.com has it first. And then maybe Group Break Checklist might probably be working on it as we speak. They might have that ready by tomorrow. Oh, to fill Traquan Smith's spot? I mean, maybe. I just feel like trades just doesn't happen, at least with those wide receivers. Trades like that don't happen very often. Think about, like, especially for, like, skill position players, like, on the offensive side. You have to relearn an entire playbook. You have to learn a new language, basically, for all these plays. I don't know if Devontae Parker's the kind of player where you say it's just go and run, like, draw plays in the sand for Devontae Parker. I just don't think he's that kind of player. So that's why we don't see trades happen too often. With defensive backs, I could see that happen more often. There's Anthony Johnson because they can be more reactive to certain plays. But even then, that's why we don't see midseason trades because there's so much to, to learn on a football team. Not like basketball or baseball where you get a major injury. You can get a guy, let's plug in that guy to plug in that spot. There's Anthony Johnson for the Buccaneers. That'll be for Michael Blunt. So, like, and I think so many football teams are so reluctant to move assets, draft assets. There's David Montgomery to 149. So, 
That's why I don't think like the trade speculation is just not as not as easy to kind of predict as it would be with like baseball or basketball. There's David Johnson. Mothra, you think the East Coast is murder an Eagles Raiders merger? How would that ha how would that work? It's not like the Steagles from back in the day, Mothro. They're kind of on opposite sides of the country. I don't know if I don't know if that would realistically work. <laughs> There's Dalvin Cook to seventy five. Raiders getting Ngakwe. I wouldn't mind that. See, I, I think you're actually... I actually um, think that, that like, a defensive end would be easier to pick up because you're just kind of like, hey, just use your physical assets just to rush the passer, go get him. Might be an easier transition after a trade. Unless there's like some rela previous relationship with an old offensive coordinator or something like that. And I don't know that off the top of my head, so it'll be hard to see. But nice Dwayne Haskins, camo refractor. And that'll be for Nathaniel with the Redskins. Nice one. Two out of 25. But I wonder if the Raiders are content with just kind of playing out this, this season and not really moving any more draft picks. All right, four boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Almost there. We got David Montgomery to 99. We got Daniel Jones to 249. We got Karen Higdon to 75. Chiefs should trade. Chiefs should get at as much defense as possible. There's Larry Johnson speaking of the Chiefs. Sensational signature is another great one for the X line and the Chiefs. Another great sensational signature. Had Russell Wilson before. Now for the X line, we got Larry Johnson. So let's set that out there. We'll keep track of the three autos. We got Archie Manning to 149 for the Saints. There's Jalen Ferguson, 75. It was there last night, Mothro. It is new sign, though. That is the first Chiefs hit. Maybe there is one other one, but that's the first significant Chiefs hit. There's Jalen Ferguson. For the Ravens, that'll be for Joe Howard. There's out of 175, Derwin James. Tiggs is saying, Bill's saying, Joe, those teams can do what they want. doesn't matter. The Patriots win another Super Bowl. Yeah, it kind of looks like it, doesn't it? There are some cracks in the... Uh, there are some cracks in the in the Patriots armor though. You know? That running games Sony Michelle has been scored some touchdowns against the Jets, but there's been some running issues previous to that. Defense is doing a lot of work. A lot of extra work maybe. There's been some little issues here and there. There's Bryce Love. For Nathaniel, but the problem is people can't score on the on the Patriots just yet. So, there's Bryce Love. Bryce Love to 
Well, it's not a it, the the letters don't change on that sign, moth. It, they're they're kind of they're fixed. It's just a light in there. It's not a LED sign with different lettering. There's Darius Slayton to 149. There's T.Y. Hilton, Refractor, and Dalvin Cook to 199. Gilo, what's going on? Derek Barnett to 249. TD saying the Devin White one of one's already been pulled. It's time to burn cases then, forget it. Prism is dead. All right, three boxes to go. There's Bradley Chubb to 149. Do they have a mic right on the ump? <laughs> no. Jalen Ferguson. Ravens, Joe Howard. Not numbered, I think he had not numbered. There's Nick Vanette to 175 for the Seahawks. We got Montez Sweat to one. I love those Montez Sweat commercials. I think they're pretty funny, the Old Spice commercials. Easton Stick to 149. Chargers, John Purdy. The Chargers season keeps going downhill. I wonder if they I wonder if they throw Easton Stick out there for a couple games, see see what he has. 82 out of 149. Matt DeLeo, no worries. You're welcome. I'm glad glad we had things to send you. Drew Bledsoe to 199. There's Taylor Rapp to 99. But I missed a parallel for a second. In a parallel spot. Richard Sherman, who was talking about you? Crabtree to 249. We got Adrian Peterson to 75. Got a nice uh, warm reception at Minnesota yesterday. Trace McSorley, Baltimore Ravens. That will be for Joe. I don't think I don't think Trace McSorley will be getting a chance anytime soon. Oh, River still has his consecutive game streak going, says Sean. So no way they cut that off. Well, maybe you put him in at the end of the game. Charge are getting blown out. Put him in the second, is it fourth quarter, or something like that. See what he has. I think Matt Ryan has a consecutive game streak going too. There's Miles Sanders to 149. That's what makes me think they'll, that he'll try to run out there. Play for a couple quarters. Maybe Dan Quinn wants to save his job. You got to roll Matt Ryan out there if you want to save your job, right? Chargers don't get. That's not to say they can't ever get blown, not get blown out, right, Sean? It's possible. I just want to see what what we have in Easton Stick. Are we not curious? Danielle Hunter to one seventy five. Hashtag good for the hobby. Clayton Thorson. I think he like shredded an ACL 
in his in a preseason game. Eagles with that one. He looked pretty good up until then. Paul Hutchins with the fly. Eagles fly. Mike Evans to 199. There's Brian Urlacher to 249. Oh uh, yeah, the, that the end of that Chargers. I had no. I had no you know, skin in that game, but I was just watching it on local TV. That fumble was that, that was pretty brutal. Zach Allen for the Arizona football Cardinals. That goes to Aaron Pettit. Four out of 10 for the Cardinals. Once again, There's DeAndre Hopkins to 49. Ooh, Deon Juan Soto. I know it's a football break, but we got some World Series action on the background. Two out, bottom of the third. Two outs, two men on. Juan Soto up to bat. Birthday, birthday magic here. Birthday go ahead home run. There's Lamar Jackson out of 99. Is Terry McLaurin to 249. You're welcome for the Bo Jackson, too, EA. And I don't know where those shot shakers are. Man. Tough crowd. Out of 149, Cameron Jordan. Got Melvin Ingram. To 175. And DK Metcalf. Nice. Green scope autograph for Harry Morgan and the Seahawks. 75 out of 75. And there's Julian Love. All right, and the last box. Three autos to go. Good luck, everybody. Harrison Smith to 25. Be, would you be? Yeah, I don't, I don't know if you would be. I think then it'd be like, why wasn't it numbered? And if it was numbered, why wasn't it lower numbered? Tim Brown to 149. Emmanuel Sanders to 199. Broncos. Well, there's one AJ Brown. No ink yet. Maybe we're getting warmer. EA out of 249. Titans. Why wasn't that autographed? Tough crowd, ladies and gentlemen. There's Daryl Henderson. Poor Carrion Johnson to 75. Oh, and that Harrison Smith for the Vikings was to 25. Chris Hernan the fourth to 99. What if there are no auto? We haven't seen the auto yet. What if there are no autos in here? Ted Ginn Jr. to 175. There's Nelson Aguilar to 199. Juan Soto walked. 
Bobby Wagner, and we've got Tyree Jackson, our first auto out of here. Now with the final box, Buffalo, Aaron Pettit with the Bills. To 149. A redemption is our second autograph. Our third autograph, there's Christian Kirksey to 249. That's for the Browns. That'll be for Glenn Campbell. Our final autograph is Travis Homer, Seattle Seahawks. That will be for Harry Morgan. Here's Nick Bosa, Miles Gaskin, and Redemption Time. Good luck, everybody. We have Rookie Patch, Rookie Patch Autographs Prism. And the player is going to be uh, the guy that never signs his cards, Marquise Brown. There he is. Marquise, come on. Okay, if you're watching, come on. Joe Howard with the Ravens. Joe, you got to go over there and be like, Marquise, come on. Got to sign your cards, buddy. All right, after the randomizer for the break credit and the points, we will do a quick autograph recap. All right, so let's go back to the list. Everyone has a shot at the 500 points, two 250s. And you have to buy at least two teams if you want a shot at the break credit. So let's alphabetize this list. Two teams gets you one entry. If you buy four teams, you get two entries, so on and so forth. All right, so Aaron's got two. Anne has three, but only two count, so you get one entry. EA, two. Harry is in. John McCall is in. X-Line is in. Michael Gallucci is in. Randall is in. And that's it. That's only eight people. Only eight people taking advantage of the promo. So you have a one in eight chance at 100 bucks of break credit. Probably the best odds for that much, of break, for that much break credit. All right, we'll use the same dice roll for both lists. And it's going to be four and a one, five times. Points first. One, two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five times, it's Randall. There you go, Randall. Randall with the points. Now, let's see who gets the $100 of break credit. Once again, after five times, four and a one. Good luck. One, two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five times, Aaron Pettit. There you go, Aaron. Congrats to you. A hundred bucks of break credit going your way. Um, folks, we've got more Prism in the store. Brand new release just dropped today. You can pick your team or we have half case random teams as well. So check out the random team version of the brand new Prism football. This is Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Almost forgot about this. Here's the recap video from the last box to the first box. Homer, Tyree, Marquise, DK, Zach Allen to 10, Clayton, Trace, Easton, a few quarterbacks, Jalen, Love, Ferguson. I love these sensational signatures. Larry Johnson. 
Dwayne Haskins camo. That was pretty cool. That's the 25. Terry Godwin, the second. More Marquise Brown. Jack Doyle. That color burst was pretty sick. Juju Smith Schuster. Russell Wilson. It was pretty nice. A little some some more vet autos in here this year, which is pretty cool. Awesome flashback autograph that EA doesn't really care about to 25. But as a Raiders guy, I care about it. Irv Smith, Drew Locke, another flashback autograph, Thurman Thomas, Gaskin, Daryl Henderson, Darius Slayton, Isabella, Deontay Thompson, Bryce Love again, Dexter Williams, and we started off with Brian Burns for the Carolina Panthers. That's to 75. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is now officially the end of Pick Your Team 2. Appreciate everybody watching. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.